Hello dear friends, I want to paint some sky with uh, digital painting so I search online, use different kind of uh, keyword I use very much often very often I use uh, Pinterest or just uh, Google or just a search image for whatever I want mountain sky Another one, this one is a sky. All kinds of skies. Pretty. And this one is a summer sky. Oh, they are so beautiful. I love to use Pinterest. I love to use whatever. Just so many good ideas people sharing the idea and sharing it's a, a place where we can find inspiration and find new ideas so you search so we want to do a landscape and uh, first there is mountain we want to do a tree mountain tree like this one there is a tree there is mountain there is a sky and on the bottom I would like to put up some tree so I will borrow different ideas and put all these things put the things together it may not be from one particular picture because I'm not good at, at uh, reproducing uh, another work it's my weakness so you take advantage of your weakness and avoid um, avoid to challenge yourself too much just be lazy so do whatever you can do and uh, do not struggle to do something you cannot so here I would like to see this sky and this sky amazing sky is done found on photo editing inspiration tips inspiration and by Anders Hansen at me.com Thank you Henderson or thank you for whoever artist made this painting. Actually this guy is also this sky is also very very amazing. So we get the idea something like blue and red and pink, orange, all these colors combined together to make a sky right so let's see we take inspiration from this one and combine with this one a little bit so you will see the sky blue sky at the, at the further away uh, at the upper part and the color grading uh, slowly gradually from dark blue into purple pink orange and then mountain so and the color is this way, color the 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 the, the cloud and the lines this way. So let's start. I will start. I'm putting my password. So I have played around just to play around. Now I need to start a new one. Or oh, how about I just erase or delete all these layers? Let me delete one layer, press it long time, longer enough, so this pop up, so you delete this layer. Oh, oh, looks a little bit better, right? Looks like uh, illusion. Um, and we delete this, put this layer up. See, this layer are some white dots. Uh, I was playing around with it just now. So we will delete this layer also. And now we will delete this layer. Mm, it's clear. Ho oh, ho, it's a black background. So we change into white background white background background color is white okay 
So this is the sky we are going to do. And in iPad, this is Sketchbook Pro. You use two fingers, two fingers to touch it. You can, you can move around this uh, picture. Oh, oh, that's my. It's becoming a little bit too, uh, uh, too. Um, okay, too much. It's too active. Sometimes you do not want your your um, smart device too smart. They are just way too smart. Again, it's too smart. Come back. So slowly, if you do it too slow, it becomes a, a, a picture. It becomes all the tools disappear, become a file. And now press on it so we start to work very quickly so you can move around you can turn around and you see when it is almost correct click it snaps it's fun right the ring do do the ring the ring okay so we will make it because at the beginning it's a very very large um, what is let me just open a new file it's it's a vertical so we should walk this way actually okay this is our sky this will be our sky so we have blue color and uh, the upper part is quite dark blue. We will use this blue and we use an airbrush. Use as m this is the, 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 the width of the airbrush. You can see ooh, 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 becoming larger, 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 larger. And this one is the transparency of this uh, uh, airbrush. So this is almost non existence very 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 transparent and then become quite uh, opaque uh oh go back you can always go back now we choose the tool airbrush tool so if we do it very strong see whoa immediately it's very very dark color we do not want it so dark. And I found that this blue is not pretty. We should use a prettier blue. How about this one, right? And we make the transparency so much lighter. And first we delete this layer or clear this layer. Let's start our life again. It's 2015, a new year, new start. And then we will make our transparency very, very light, extremely light, and as light as possible. So you can see it's almost non-existence, right? You keep on sweating. It starts to show up. Keep on, keep on, keep on, keep on, keep on, keep on, keep on. Okay, let's say each time is 1% and you do 100%, it becomes 100%, right? It just takes time. And this is too slow. We do not want to walk so slow, right? We need to, we need to keep on walking. That is not good. Let me just kick it out. Why do we kick it out? Use it, right? So we make the transparency a little bit more. See, now it starts to show up. Then we will use a little bit more blue. Choose color. 
sorry. Um, okay. Airbrush. The tr no, it should be darker. Let's just use this palette. It's so much faster. Okay, darker, and we need to change the transparency of of it a little bit further. See, okay, and now we will start to add some. Uh, let's do some very very pale blue. This blue. What a beautiful blue. Too early. No, not good. We will put this blue from much lower part here. Okay. And now we will start to add in some much very, very dark. Now we will add some um, uh, purplish, pinkish color. Yeah, that looks good, right? Okay. Since our airbrush should be thinner. Okay. Oh, that's too much should be thinner and less transparent okay. okay now we start to use even lighter color okay we change use these two change into these two i like these two Okay, now orange, orange color, a bit more red, then much yellowish orange, then we have much more choice here, right? At the bottom it's all yellow. It's, uh, I'm sorry, I take so much time, so, so much of your time. It's just an experience. There is no end of how much you can do with it. It takes a lot of practice. You keep on doing, doing, doing until you find your right way of doing it, right? There's no end of it. So our very first layer, we are done with it. So this is the layer. Let's let me put some white color. Let me talk about the birds and the bees and the bird and the darling, the ring, the tree, Let me talk about the bird and the bee and the bird and the bee the run the the run the. Okay, so <clears throat> this is with the background of white color. How about we put into sunshine? Sunshine is the uh, sunset. Sunset, we put the background. We change only the background. We can change the whole world. Okay, let's see. Let me talk about the bird and the bee. That, okay, we put a pink background. Look at it, it looks like sunshine, sunset, right? We put it a little bit warmer background. It's, we use a red. Oh, I love this. Don't you love it? Okay, and uh, this very, very soft, tender purple. Mm, it's like a foggy morning. And we change into a bright yellow, yellow. Ooh, yeah. This is, this is 
in the ocean, the sun started to 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 rise up, all falling down. Okay, and we change into to touch the green green grass of home. Green. So you can play around with it to change into a different color, right? So this is the color without cloud. It's a sunset color. Change into a sunset color. A sunset or it by putting different background you add different add up into a particular a particular character of the sky. Do something. I just cannot get enough of this fun and make the airbrush much thinner, thinner. Okay, so we will choose this color. Oh, that's too much. Back. That's a little bit too much. We just need to change the transparency. We can use the same, not same, little bit smaller. Okay, little bit larger size. Okay, let's see how it goes. Bamal, 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 bamal. Très bon. Oh, même très bon. Okay. And I would like to put some yellow color. Oh, love it. And I would like to add some blue color. Okay, so just play around with it and see how you end up with. <sighs> so that's the sky. Okay. And I will do another video. I will do another video and then we'll go to the mountain. How about we are done with the sky? and put the background back into white. It's still good. It just do, do not have a hue of it, do not have a character, a particular uh, a senti sentimental feeling of the sky. But it's not that bad. Okay, we will add up another layer. I do not want to damage this layer, so I want to uh, do some white cloud on on top of this. So uh, on this on this uh, um, on this guy, we will add up some cloud. So we will put some lighter blue color, not exactly exactly white color. And this time, let's see, we use airbrush, but with a certain texture. I do not know airbrush, if airbrush has texture. Let's see. Yes, airbrush also has a texture on it. That's very good. And we need a much larger size of this airbrush. So come back to airbrush, much larger size. And we need a texture. Which texture do we need? How about this one? No. How about this one? This one. This one. This one. This one looks not that bad. Not that. A little bit too light. This one not too bad. So we are working on second layer. No? What happened? Yes, we are working on the second layer. And uh, some of this blue here. I think we need to change some white color also to make it more interesting. Now I will blow it up a little bit. 
and here we will add up some uh, uh, pink color and here we have more color to choose from I like this one first that pink then light pink good so the upper part is some light lighter pink and lower part darker pink and blue Come back to blue, some dark blue, and now we will need to smear it a little bit. That's too much. This one should be okay. Oh, it's too large, so use a much, much, much smaller. This actually is already not that bad by itself. So, but uh, still, we want to we want to we want to smear it. We want to smear it. Smear, smear, smear. How about this one? Almost non-existent. Good. Have some interesting texture. So, three sky, maybe we should have another sky, right? Uh, 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 another cloud. So, this one we have yellow. Oh no. Where is this cloud? Yellow. Okay. Yellow. Yellow. We need uh, texturing. Texturing. This texture. Mm -hmm. 
don't worry there is don't worry be happy you will always find a way to fix all this matter don't worry be happy don't worry you will always find a way to fix the unexpected good okay so the sky we will do like this i'm done with it okay the sky is flying a little bit whoosh so how about a layer of uh, mountain montagne en fait la montagne ici and this layer is the mountain mountain we will have a very dark dark blue and we will use a um, paintbrush. How about we use just a splash some This texture, how about I use this texture? This is the texture I want. Okay, can you see it? You cannot distinguish much of the light. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So we will have one layer like this. The mountain.
Then we will have another layer of mountain, much lighter this degree. Why it's not light? No, it does not look right. Okay, let me close this layer and we will do it again. We will use this brush. <laughs> we will use a texture of this texture and uh, transparency opacity minimum maximum maximum oh 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 little bit larger radius okay so we do first layer uh -uh. Show layer. Okay, we will work on this layer. This layer we will not show it. I plan to. Okay. I need to increase the size of the brush a little bit. Okay, there is one layer of mountain. put some texture on top of it so where is our texturing tool it is here that's a good one that looks a little bit like oh yeah how I love it I just love it good good Good, better than I expected. Just slowly do it. Okay, and then the rest will be covered by the second layer. Okay, now we will do the second layer of mountain. That will be, I think, this one. I think three layer is good enough, so this will be the layer of Okay, now we use the last pure black layer. Okay, so we'll start here. Mm-hmm. 
So let's take a look here. Three layers of mountain and uh, and uh, the sky. So this layer, if we show up, it's okay actually. It does not because it's covered up. If we close this layer this, from further away, it's uh, just okay. Anyway, does not damage us to make another layer. So this is the sky, this is the layer, and we can put some tree on top of it, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and uh, we can totally make six layers. And the background is another story, so we can actually have seven layers plus the background. It's important to use the 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 the. the, the. It's important to use these uh, uh, layers so that you can you can hide some mistakes, at least for me because I'm not that good. Okay, so. The tree, we want to make it just a silhouette. And we want to use this uh, felt brush from scene to, to ooh, ooh. now we will see the strength of it. Now I see the radius is like this and maximum, minimum. We want to make a diff. Mm -mm. We want to make a difference. When you put maximum, when you put maximum, so you put a lot of strength on it. It's the tree branch is is wider, and when you put with very light strength, the tree branch is much thinner. This is what I feel. Maximum, minimum. Okay, and. Uh, we do not need much about texture, but it doesn't hurt to have a good texture, right? So which texture we are going to have? How about this texture? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I hesitate. Let me see. Mm. Which layer are we working on? Why I do not see it? Does it not yet show up? Hello, come up! No, not this layer. No, not this layer. No, not this layer. Ah oh, yeah, we are doing it on this original layer. No, that's not good. Dash is not good. Okay, we will do on this layer. Okay, open up our existing layer. I like to work on this layer and protect it at the same time. And we will put on the tree. Let's blow it up a little bit. We will do it on this layer. Okay. Why I'm using much thinner? So no, this is not good. Just delete this layer. Okay, we will do it again. We will choose another texture. How about this texture? Mm, let's see. No, it's not a good one. How about this? Let's just use a. A smooth line without any texture, right? Let's see the texture. No texture. No texture. This texture. This. This. No. This. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay. This text and uh, the width. I'm sorry, I'm not so skillful on that. 
maximum, minimum. Oh, I still do not. It's on this layer. I'm sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry. I am sorry. So sorry. Really. So 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 so. So 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 so. So so so. So, 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 so.
did I do? Make it transparent. Did I touch something to make it transparent? Transparent, what are you doing with me? I hate you. Don't do that to me. You not you make me you anyway, you make me uh 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 This one, opacity, 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 oh yeah, okay, uh -uh. okay, ah, white layer, I made into transparent layer, no, no, no. I want to walk on this lane. You make me mm 
this color. Strange. Strange. Let me, let me talk about the birds and the bees and the birds and the bees and the birds and the bees. And the bees and okay, good. Bye-bye. 
dun Email.